Welcome back to Fabric. I did check the walkthrough for that level, and I was pretty close to doing what you're supposed to, but not quite. There was one tiny change, pretty much. So we'll do that, but before I do that, I wanted to just complete this intermission level, because I think it's an intermission level, because it did have shitty frame rate before I turned off the worms, which I've done. And if you don't complete the intermission, they don't count as like actual levels as far as I know. They don't show up on the level select. You just have to get to them by beating the last level in a sector. So if I were to quit now and go do that other level, then I would have to replay the flippy flippy level and get to this one again. So let's just start by doing this thing and yeah, you can't, okay, I see what you're supposed to do in this level and you can't like, oh my god, that's gonna take forever. Oh no, it's not, because you can drop down at the end. I thought you were going to have to corkscrew the entire thing. But no, you just have to, like, keep flipping with these blocks over and over and over. So that's fine. And yeah, I hope at the end here we can just fall down. I think so. I think we can just... Holy shit, that was close. Yeah, I think I can just fall down like this. Hooray! Log entry 56. From the beginning, I knew the end would host the trickiest... The trickiest what? Puzzles? The trickiest... Tricks? So yeah, I'm gonna jump back now. We can generate worms again. Oh god, can we? No, that drops like 60 on this level. Alright, fair enough. No worms. I guess we'll not play with worms until the frame rate gets back up. Wow. Oh yeah, this is the one I saw that looked kind of insane. There's like, it's like a maze. Oh boy. Oh shit, I think I get how this is done, but... Or not like, right away I have to solve it, but... Ah! And then you have this to, like, start the maze. But yeah, I'm gonna go back to the main menu and redo that one level. So, I was very close. Instead of placing it here, you place it on this edge. That should be fine. Just, like, right there. Or maybe one more over here. Something like that. Because then we can do exactly what I did before. Flip over here. Then back off and here, which I guess is intended because, like, the, the next level over had some insane, like, pinpoint flip on the correct side thing, so that makes sense. Now, instead of dropping off the edge here, which I did, which you could do, again, you're just supposed to flip over here and then walk down this side, which, obviously, that makes sense. But then the problem is, if I had it in my original spot, I couldn't do anything now, so you have to, like, peek out and, well, I guess I can flip to, doesn't really matter, but I can try to flip to this side, just to, like, actually get on the correct orientation. Not that it matters, but there we go. So that's how you're meant to do it. Thanks to the guy who make, made the walkthrough. Unfortunately, I can't thank him by name, because I don't know how to pronounce it. It's like a Russian name or something, but thanks, you did it. That was very helpful. So, let's do a maze. Let's see how this all works out. So I guess this is just sort of to see. Oh yeah, you can like prepare it. I see. Right, because if we go this way, and we drop down here, we would flip to this side. And then... Wait, what? Wait, why do you need to be here? That's a bit odd. I don't know what the purpose of that is, because you can just jump down this way instead. Yeah, and now you sort of enter the maze. But now, since we haven't started flipping, there's no way to go. Oh, that's what that is. That's like for uh, getting out. Well, again, that's very kind of him. Normally, uh... Normally you don't get those second chances at all. 
Huh. Okay, so we need to make sure there's a path to... Let's check the map here. Okay, wow, the frame rate. Even though worms are off, frames are still not on. So we need to get here. Need to see this one, which you do from right here. So that's our goal. Getting somewhere in here. Okay. Alright, doesn't seem too hard, so let's just see what we can do. We need to end up in this courtyard kind of thing at some point, or anywhere up here works as well. So obviously you have to start with that. Oh, well, okay, I guess that's fine. Maybe I have to, I probably have to, hold on, let's unbend. I probably have to do this, oh god, wait. You're not supposed to do this, I think. Like, be on this rotation. Okay, but you can't do anything weird with it. Yeah, I'm thinking we don't want to flip or do the first bend right away. Do we want to do all of them? Is it just like a case of uh, bending all of them together in the correct order? Does that work? I doubt this works, but let's see. And then maybe you just unbend when you're at certain locations. So like, unbend here. And walk out. No. Um, let's try unbending again. No, I fucked up somewhere. Okay, so now I'm in Flickerland. Now I'm right here. So how do you... Hmm. Okay, let's restart. I think restarting is faster than like flipping out and walking all the way back. So let's think about it. If I do that... Wait, you, wait, you could walk around there? I didn't think you could. Was I just blind? I thought that was like blocked. I thought I got in here and then, okay, hold on. Let's just try it again then. Maybe I just didn't see something super obvious. I, I thought it like, whoa, that was weird. I was walking on the air because I was bending and you can't like fall through bended space or something, bent space. Oh, oh my god. Well, okay, never mind. I just didn't see something very obvious. Then we unbend here, go this way, and then, oh, QR code. Well, knock yourself out. I don't have any, like, QR scanner or anything. I don't have a smartphone. Yep, I am that old. So, enjoy. If you have a smartphone, feel free to scan that and tell me what it is, because I have no idea. But now, we just want to go probably in here, I would imagine. Yeah, okay, that's fine. And there we go, level complete. Cool. Yeah, that was a pretty neat level. If you just see the, the passage. 57. All I had learned was to be demonstrated but the essential ingredient to success was sheer determination. Very motivational. Can we turn on worms again? Sort of. Not really. Nope. Okay, fine. I'm just gonna leave worms off. I guess worms are just really bad in this sector in general. Should probably uh, look at the map. Get my bearings, see what the hell you're supposed to do. Please stop. Okay, try another direction. Nope. 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 Well, I guess I can just walk over here, like that. Now it can't flicker, even if it is flickering. So yeah, I should just do that. 
So we have three red blocks and one yellow block. And a, a good old checkpoint. Haven't seen those in a while. I see. So you can like... Uh... No, maybe not. I was thinking if you flip up, you can like land here. Yeah, no, I think you can. If you stand here, you can flip up, fall up onto the green block, then walk over here, then flip down, and you can be here if you need to be. Which... Don't know if you... No, I... Yeah, yeah, that would work. So we need to unpower this. And then I can flip up, flip down, walk through, drop down, get the key block, which is like right in here. And then I, sh I can just flip down again or like that way to save myself. Yeah, that's fine. So we just need to break the connection to this wall in some way without eliminating... No, you can't eliminate the green block or the... The yellow block or anything. Alright, so let's just keep thinking. So after I have that, I'll have the key, I'll be back at the start. How do I get to the end then? To get to the end, I need to... I think I need to be on this rotation. Ah, I see. So then you just need to power this again, drop to this rotation, and then you just walk off into the end. Yeah, okay, I get it. This seems simple enough. So, let's start by breaking the power block. And how do we do that? Does that work? No. Does this work? No. So you need to break the entire thing. Maybe that'll cause some problems in my plan. But we'll see. For now, I think we're fine. So then... I drop down here, and then to the green block, then save us, then drop down again. I gotta sneeze, one second. I'm alive, I'm alive. And now we just walk through here, and drop down to the key block. There we go, and we can drop this way. Now we just unbend everything. Yeah, there we go. And... Ooh. Oh no, can't do that. Um... Okay, this might be the problem here. Because I can't... Huh. I mean, I can, like, jump over here. Can I then flip up? I can. I don't know if that's what you're meant to do. But now I got it. Yep, we're done. Okay. How else were you meant to get down from there? Huh. I'm not entirely sure how you're meant to... ...not die there, unless you just use one of the white blocks. But I guess that's fine. Right? That didn't seem too cheaty. 58. A timelessness surrounded me. I felt a rush, but forced to stop and think. And English. And English good. Now our frame rate is good again, so now I'm gonna turn on the worms. Yep, seems fine. Okay. Green block, blue block, let's check the map and... Okay, it's not flickering. I was gonna walk to the edge. So we got some red blocks here. This one and that one are lined. And these are lined, but they're also aligned. No, they're one block above. Are they? They don't look to be... Hold on, can I just check that? No, okay. They're, they're lined. Now I can just look off the edge like this. Oh, it still flickers, though. Ah, that's a problem. Okay, fine. Let's just do it here. That worked. 
So we need to somehow like flip around, flip around, flip around and get over here maybe. And then, hmm, I don't even know. What do we do here? So we need to be here and somehow, yeah, you can. Okay, so we need to be right there and flip. Wait, no, that doesn't work. That would kill you. I was going to say flip on this side, because you need to stand here. But you can't do that, can you? I almost feel like this is more of a... Just try to do it and we'll see what happens kind of map. Huh. Huh. Yeah, that doesn't really help me at the start. I think at the start, the only thing I can do is flip over here. But maybe now I would want to, like, turn something off. Not sure. Wait, no, that's the other one. Right? Wait, where am I? That's the start. I thought there was a, a block over here. Well, there probably is, but I guess I need to flip there. Like so, and then we flip down. Yeah, there it is. Okay. Shit! Damn it! I don't know if I want to combine something yet. So far, I'm just kind of flipping around. Wait, I think I'm doing this instead and then flipping up. So I'm aligning myself. Oh. Oh. Okay. Oh, God, I thought it... Okay, we're fine. Save here. Hopefully that save isn't broken, but maybe it is. Oh, that doesn't work. Ah, oh, shit, I can't be here. Well, I can... stand here... and flip up. Nope, come on. Like that. Now I could bend them together if I want to. Is that necessary? I don't know why that would be necessary. Really? You can't unbend in midair, can you? I'm thinking like if we bend these together, then stand here, then bend or like switch gravity and then right click right away. Oh no, no, that is that is fine. You don't need to do that cuz we just remove this wall and now we can just land here safely. Wow, that's it. That's the level. Well, that was super easy. Okay, I, I was making that a lot more complicated. All the red blocks were, again, just red herrings. He sure likes placing just random shit that is supposed to confuse you, I suppose. 59. I left the majority of my mind's coherence within that box. Oh boy, 30 frames a second. Oh jeez, even without worms, this is like... No! Holy crap, what is going on here? If I look in this direction, it drops to like 40 frames without worms. If I look in this direction, 400 frames. What is going on in this level? Where did I even start? Right there. Oh. No? Is it just the amount of blocks that's causing a problem? There's the exit. Oh boy. It's like, oh dear, okay. It's in a giant, it's in a giant box. My coherence, it's right here. 
I see, and you have to, like, enter it in different ways or something. Well, don't think looking at the map is gonna do too much on this level. You just kinda have to do stuff, I think. Can't do that. Oh my god! Oh my god, the frame rate, please. That's awful. That is really, really bad. I can bend together these if I want to. Oh god, and then I can unbend here. Oh dear, and I'm stuck. Now I'm dead. Goodbye. Holy shit, Parkour Master! Okay. Oh, I could have just, like, dropped down. Yeah, I think you were just meant to drop off. I mean, I don't even think you're meant to be here. But... I can. Let's get over here. I can, like, get to the green block already, if I want to. What is happening? What am I doing? I'm pretty sure I'm doing... very wrong stuff. Hey, green block. Thanks. Oh, frames. So now I just flip back up. And we can enter the box. Where do I even want to go? Alright, fine. I'll just drop down. Ah, I see. Okay, so let's get back up. Um. Oh yeah, how would you do this? Huh. Yeah, everything is like... I guess I need to use something like this to help me. Like that. Does that do anything? Let me check the map quick. Sorry. Oh god, the frame rate and the flickering. Everything is horrible. I'm in here. I want to be free. I want to get in here somehow. So... Ah... Uh, I don't know, maybe I can just like actually jump it? Wait, wasn't it there? Oh, it was there. Well, if I'm on that side, I could probably do that. Which... Doesn't seem like a good thing to do. Oh, wait. Oh. Oh, it's that simple. Oh, my God. I can just... Jesus Christ. Okay. Well, there we go. Key block. Okay. So now you drop out, I would imagine. Ah, yeah. Now we leave the box. And we have to get out somehow. So where's the exit again? Right there. Can I just fall out? Is that fine? Is there something to catch me? There is. Oh, no. Okay, there is. Yep. And you get the save block again. I did something wrong here, but let's just keep going. So then we can flip up this way. And how... Still flicker. Still flicker. Still flicker. Good enough. So how do we get to the exit? Holy crap, the frame rate is so bad in this level. So the exit is right here. Oh my god, it's so hard to control. Right there. Nope. I want to see the passages. I guess I can't. So it's just right here. So we need to land on this side. And to do that, we need to be right here. Oh god. Oh god, the lag, please. Please. We need to be right here. And for that to happen, I think we need to, like, 
bend those together, maybe? Maybe. If we assume that that's the case, and then drop from here... Can we go from here, maybe? Oh boy, I might have to, like, cut this one off and retry it next time, because I do want to try and, like, get there the normal way as well, because I did something really strange. Um... Yeah, I'm not too sure. And this is not where I can, like, drop off. Is it? I mean, I guess I can, but not really. And I could drop off all the way down there. Oh boy. What am I doing? What am I doing? What am I doing? I am not doing this the way you're meant to. Might be able to finish it though, and then replay it next time. So now we need to get over- oh, oh, you don't even have to, like, use the red blocks. Are the red blocks again just stupid, pointless, nothings? Yeah, like that, and then we just bend in. I think I got it. What the hell is wrong with all the red blocks? Hey! Cool! 60! Also, I think with all the intermissions, there were 60 levels in... Wait. No, that doesn't add up. Or does it? No. I don't know, I, I'm thinking it's gonna be like 64 log entries, because there's 10 levels in each... No, right, there's 9 levels in Sector 6, which is the last one that we're in now. So, there's 5 intermissions. Yeah, this makes sense. So, 6 sectors, 10 levels each, but only 9 levels in Sector 6, which is 59 levels, and then in between each one, there's a an intermission with a log entry. Which is 64, because 64, like, bits and binary shit, he seems to like that. Log entry 60. Sanity was being drained away, leaving its place to apprehension. I mean, in a way, I'm apprehensive about doing things that I know are clearly not intended. But there we go, I'll leave it there for today, and yeah, next time I'll go back and try to redo that level, and... Maybe do it in a better way. Maybe. Hope you enjoyed the episode, though. Thank you very much for watching, and I'll see you next time. Bye-bye!